Hey everybody, I'm uh, having a little challenge with this eye, but we're not going to talk about that today. What I'm wanting to talk to you about is um, some things that we have in common. It doesn't really even matter who you are. There are some things I've been thinking about talking to you for a really long time. It's one of them. And I'm always thinking about things that we have in common that we could talk about. Or a way to feel a camaraderie instead of a separation, right? Well, there are three things that we both, both you and I, no matter who you are and what moment I can, I've been thinking about this, <laughs> I can I can't say guarantee, but almost guarantee that we have this in common, okay? Uh, time, energy, and money that we both spend and save all three of those things, right? And possibly do them differently. We both probably spend time differently and we save time differently. I would say that there's seven billion different ways of both saving and spending time, you know, but we have it in common that we like to do that because of how our we are going by a concept of time. If you weren't uh, utilized, Tink wants to come in, hang on. If you, <clears throat> if you weren't using a computer right now, or a television, or an electronic means of watching me, I could say possibly you had transcended the, the concept of time, uh, and that there are probably tribes in Africa or elsewhere on the planet that have actually transcended uh, the concept of time. But... I think you and I have that in common. So we spend and save time. And we both spend and save energy. Right? And we both spend and save money. Well, you know, I mean the money one is very much a part of our culture and and all cultures going on in the world except those that have also stepped outside of the concept of time. Right? If we think about it. If they have not used clocks to make their systems work, then they also don't really have the concept of money to make their systems work. And uh, energy, I'd have, to, I would have to venture to guess that they have tons of energy, both saved and there to utilize. You know, without the time and money aspects. Anyway, I've been thinking about that one for a very long time just wanting to get your thoughts because really you know the point zero on our clocks that's, that says today is what May 20 let's see what time I have right now is Monday May 28th <clears throat> at 338 p.m. Mountain Standard Time so um, you know, you have a clock somewhere that's telling you what time it is in this moment that you're watching this. And, uh, actually it's all kind of the same thing. It's that we believe in that concept of saving and, and, uh, saving money, saving time, saving energy. And do we have enough time? Sorry, I'm too busy. I don't have enough time for you right now. 
that's a valuable thing time is. And what about time like when you're having a blast and you're just having the best time of your life? Time flies when you're having fun, right? Why? Why is that? Because you've lost the attachment. To, we, I lose the attachment to time and just enjoy the now moment. Therefore, it flies like nothing. So, would we, if we were having fun and being in the moment all the time, laughing and laughing at, at just being and enjoying God in every aspect of each and every moment, would time pass? I mean, when they say time flies, is that because it's on a clock? It seemed like that time lasted forever if you're having fun, right? And would you get old if we didn't have the concept of time and clocks to save and spend and keep us roped into our chains of the money system? <laughs> you know? I don't know. It just seems to me when I've done without clocks, I squeezed more into life than any time in my life. That was the most jam-packed, blessed week I ever spent. Is that <clears throat> past I did off of clocks for, I don't remember how long, it was a while. I loved it, I want to do it again. You know? So anyway, yeah, the three things that we all spend and save are money, time, and energy. I just wanted to say, we got a lot in common, see? Even if you don't drink your pee, and I do, we still got a lot in common. <laughs> Have a great day, hun. Guys, <laughs> hun. <laughs> Whoever you are.